Hello friends, welcome to my Fabian review. Fabian is a SaaS platform that lets you create interactive demos and step-by-step -step guides for customer support, lead generation and SOPS. So no more screenshot with Fabian Chrome extension, you can record and capture any workflow to create interactive demos. Now I am inside the simple dashboard of Fabian and here I will provide you one small demo of the product. But before going into the demo, I like to mention that one link is given in the video description below and that is the AppSumo lifetime deal. One AppSumo lifetime deal is going on. Price is $49 only, 21 positive reviews are there. And based for customer support, marketer, SaaS, and you can integrate with Notion, Webflow, Webbooks, Wix, WordPress. And if you come below, you can know more about the features and benefits of the product. So these are the real terms and conditions and these are the feature details and also they provide 60 day money back guarantee. If you don't like the product for any reason, you can return it back and they will refund your money within 60 days of your purchase. Some license tiers are there. Tier 1, 2 and 3, $49, $119 and $249. So check all the features and go as per your requirement. Now again come back to the dashboard and here I will provide you a small demo of the product. So this is the simple dashboard and here you need to install the Chrome extension first. So install Chrome extension. So I need to install the Chrome extension. So I have already installed the Chrome extension. So here in your case, you can see add Chrome extension. So I have already installed it. So it is showing remove Chrome extension. And now come back again to the dashboard. So now we will create one demo. So come inside the AppSumo page here and first of all we need to pin it. From here we need to pin it. So I have already pinned it, the Chrome extension. So now what we need to do, click on this Chrome extension and record a new demo. So click on record a new demo. So first we will create on AppSumo here. And now come below. Click on new arrivals and here you will find out Fabian and now click on buy now. So for this demo purpose this much is ok. So come again here and stop recording. So it is recorded now. The demo is recorded now. So save a new demo, save as a new demo and here we need to give a name, Evan. And next, and here pick a color for the annotation box. So these are nothing but templates. So which template you want to choose? So for example, I want to go with this one. This is good. And here there are two options, pick a shape for the annotation box. So one is round shape. Yeah, so I want to go with second one, select this and now create interactive demo from here. So my interactive demo is now creating. It may take some time to generate the slides here. So there are a few slides, one, two, three, four, five, six, five slides are there. So setting up the interactive demo for you. So our interactive demo is now created. So first we click on this app sumo and here we can change this text write a brief description of what your buyer should expect. So we can change this I'll show you later on and now click on next. So this is the next step. We need to click on new arrivals next and we need to click on favorite and then we need to click on buy button here next this is the booker demo so this is a complete step there are five slides so now edit the demo so we can now start editing the demo so there are five slides you can see here five slides are there so now click on this first one and we can start editing the slides so how we can do that it is loading now so now we can change this text so here you can write, click on it, AppSumo first. 
So this is the first step. And there are various other options up there. You can change this text. You can make it bold. You can make it normal, large or extra large. You can make it italic. You can put it in the middle. So whatever you want, you can go with the customization options. And also you can select text and hyperlink. And also you can upload one image or GIF. And the best part is you can collect the email address. That means information from the customer email address phone number anything you can collect so click on lead form here so here only the email address field is there and if you want to add one new field add a new field from here so if you want to collect the first name you can collect keep it in the top and also add new field if you want to collect the country industry mobile number you can collect also so this is the way you can collect the information of your customers also from here you can record or upload the video so from here you can record your video directly and also you can upload the video here so right now i'm not uploading or recording any video you can upload the video if you want now come to branding here you can change the branding that means primary color background color font color border radius so fable watermark if you want so here you can on or off some advanced settings are also there so now come to CTA button and here next button is on and if you want to hide the next button just click on this the next button is now hide and if you want back button you can on it from here the back button is there but in my first slide I don't want any back button and if you want to add any link here also you can add that already connected to annotation so here you can add a link if you want but I don't want right now and inside the back button also you can add some link also you can add some another city here maybe you can put get a demo here this is another one city button but i don't want to delete it right now so defined effects are there so click on effects here so this is the first one clarity the next one so preview it so it will be like this then this one Preview it so it will be like this but I don't want this I want to go with first one this is okay and now other annotations are also they are sizing and positioning so here positioning auto or custom so here you can change the position of this maybe auto it is okay also you can go with custom then box sizing here you can make it small or medium or larger if you want I want to go with the medium size so this is okay and now or spot and here you can hide annotation if you want you can hide it from here I don't want and now some advanced settings are also there so click on advanced here and here entry point you can on or off entry point and also scroll adjusting scroll or auto whatever you want you want to go with auto now come above and here more options are there click on edit and here you can edit your background that means if you want to edit something you can edit from here so click on login and if you want to change this text you can change it out so I just for the example purpose I write here logout so this is how you can change any text from here few more things are there show elements or hide elements whatever you want I want to show element so now blur element if you want to blur any element you need to pick that element and you need to own it so if you want it it will be blurred and now upload mask and here you can select the resolution to so cancel it and also a few more things are there so i have made these changes inside this slide so when you finished with your slide just publish it from here so it will be published so now embed in landing page so this is the embed code you can put inside your landing page open this in our demo so you can open it in a new window so setting up the interactive demo for you so this is the demo next so here they need to put the name and email address first name and next the email format is this is the email address and next so this is the next step I have not changed everything you can see here 
So now come back again to the dashboard. So you can embed this inside any landing page and also you can share this and you can open this directly from here. So close it right now. So now come back again to the dashboard. So here there are five slides now and if you want to separate these slides in defined rows also you can do that. So you can delete this connector, delete this connector, delete it. So it will now look like this A1, A2, B1, B2, B3. So this is the way you can separate the slides also. And few more options are there in the left side. So click on add a new screen on the demo. So if you want to add one screen, you can add from here. So upload one image from here and click to upload. And here you can choose one file to create one new slide here. But I don't want right now. So you can add a new slide here. And now design your loader. So you can change this design. That means you can change this image. So now click to upload and here you can change this with your logo so for example i want to use this image as one logo so now it is uploading so it will look like this now this way you can upload your logo here and also setting up the interactive demo for you so you can change this setting up the interactive demo for you you can change this text also and also you can upload gif or loti so cross it right now and now few more things are there like create module and here you can create your modules so what is that so create module from here so heading here need to put a heading h a and module name abc is a module name module description you need to put one description also now here you need to choose a module a1 so here module abc so this is the way you can put the headline and the module name and also you can put the module description here so cross it right now and at the last mobile responsive so from here you can choose my application is mobile responsive if it is so click on this make this demo mobile responsive and also you can go with the second one my application is not mobile responsive so in portrait mode or in landscape mode but i want to go with the first one and make it mobile responsive this is an excellent demo creation tool definitely you can go with this tool the link is given in the video description below and that is AppSumo lifetime deal so you can go with the lifetime deal and if you want 10% extra discount you can go through my link so that's all about filming uh, review and a small demo if you like this video hit the like button and also subscribe my youtube channel and also don't forget to hit the bell notification because whenever i publish a new video you will be get notified instantly so thank you for today bye bye